Is this thing on? Alright, this is not part of the tournament, but I just played this guy while I was waiting between matches, and he's kind of good. I didn't record it because it wasn't part of the tournament, but you know, I'm here now, so I might as well look at it. Played Necro. Uh, usually Oro goes SA2 versus Necro, but when I'm playing for fun, I usually pick SA3 because it's more more fun. This is minus, but I don't know if Oro has a punish. If without like a red parry, I don't even know if he has a punish with a red parry. That shouldn't parry by me. It's very kind of bad, but I do it a lot. If I waited a bit more, that would have dizzied maybe. He's playing all right. Trying to win in neutral, I guess. Hard kick interacts favorably with a lot of necro pokes, but um, it's whiff punishable. Most of Oro's buttons in this matchup are. Necro's kind of good at whiff punishing. It was a risky parry by me. It could have been low short. If it was low short uh, spinning hook, that would have been pretty bad. Hmm. Trade combo. I had something better. I had walking crutch for your super. Oops, that was perfectly timed. Um, his throw, I mean, to... My stomp was going to work if I timed my stomp right. He did the right thing, that's what I was trying to say. That my stomp would have worked. Fortunately, I get this. I could, I'd crouch fear there, Fierce there for more damage, but um, I think it doesn't end up mattering. My alarm is going to run midway through this set. How long is this replay? Hold on. Fight Cade replays. This one was 10 minutes. All right. Me checking actually didn't like affect anything in the recording, which is cool. Parry on stand short. You can actually parry that either direction, so not a very good button for me to hit. Oh, that caught me off guard. Probably caught him off guard too, but his reaction of throwing was better than what I did, which was parrying. I don't even think I parried the right way. It was a punish, I think. I probably had something better. It might have actually been parryable by him now I think about it, because he recovered. Ugh, that was an accident. Oftentimes I do that, where I like do a, a tick and then I walk in car throw and I get the fucking car command grab. I always feel so bad. It's optimal to wait as long as possible before killing someone. Look at my meter. If I just killed him with the Tengu combo, I would have got no meter, but now I got a smidge. I know it sounds like nothing, and you're right, it is nothing. But, you know, you might as well do the optimal thing. Not a good button by me. It was, I think it was a failed car throw. And then that was me trying to poke him to keep him out. Pretty dire situation. Stand like kick did not beat that. Uppercut usually beats it. There's no trade combo there. I don't think. It was heavy uppercut, but I don't think there's a trade combo. There's a trade combo here. Pretty cool looking. Ah, that was well timed too. Fortunately I got this. Oops, I dropped it. I was doing it too high. Necro is extremely forgiving with his uh, chicken combo timing. It's one of the easiest in the game. But I didn't let him fall at all. I was very greedy with the timing. I was just like, eh, I don't need to do it. I don't need to be precise. And, you know. It fell out because of that. You have to do like down back fierce after that parry maybe. Or back forward or something. The parries are instant with that drill. If you actually parry, if you block, it's like the hits are far apart. I always parry there. It's very greedy of me. It works a lot, but it doesn't work a lot too. Backdash is good. So it's just shimmy. Alright, there's hope for me. It's not a whole lot of hope, but it's hope. I think here I get a launch. Yeah, and I like drop the juggle. And that was super bad. 100% like that launch should have been a kill combo. Even though I just juggled roundhouse, I think he was dizzy. I tried to juggle like a stone thing, I think. I don't think he was dizzy. But it was definitely good that I got the proper juggle, which I didn't. Nice little block. I wake up high parry. He did meaty low forward. Really bad double jump by yours, truly. Nice punish. It's going to be a much harder round to steal back. That was not a combo. And that was just, you know. I saw the dizzy bar was high. I was like, I'm going to hit roundhouse. Brain turned off. Fortunately, this time it worked. Final round. 
that jump short was kind of cool. That was probably a punish, but I didn't attack on the way down properly. It was a failed um, cross through, but he probably read it like it was a real cross through. I dashed at the wrong time, but it was very close to the right time, so it was hard to tell what was about to happen. Jump and stomp only got one hit. You can't match it out if you only get the first hit. You have to get the second hit. There it is. You also can't mash it out fully if you only get the second hit. It's like if you get both hits, you can mash it out to eight hits. If you get just the first hit, you can't mash it at all. If you get just the second hit, you can only mash it out to like four hits or five hits or something. It's very strange. Uppercut would have worked there. I should have done it. Necro players do not do regular jump. They only do chill jump. Very nice reply. I was looking for jump parry. I think I looked for jump parry several times in this round and just couldn't get it, even though I thought I was timing it right. A little dire. Jump in roundhouse was guaranteed there, and probably I should have done it. I think it was guaranteed. Not my round. Ah, uh, close forward missed, and then he got a super confirm as a whiff punish. Criminal. Playing real well this round. I don't know what I thought he would do on wake up, but he didn't do it. Whatever it was. This is Dizzy. Very nice. I didn't parry that right. I thought he would attack later. I parried on the way down, but like way later than he hit me. That's the trick. Air parries are only four frames, so there's a mix-up of when you go for the air parry. He did a nice early attack. Very smart. I'm not even sure which way I would parry it anyway. Uh, that was safe. Pretty sure. Probably stand strong as soon as I went. It would have been really good there. Because it looked pretty ambiguous with the jump and stomp. I never thought about that as a mix-up, but it's kind of good. Dizzy bar looking kind of juicy. There it is. That's probably a combo. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six hit combo. Yeah. So Brown has combo to stand forward there. That's probably a punish on my fireball. I think it was. TC was optimal there. I didn't have uh, something meaner to go for. Instant super cancel because I didn't know which hit I would get or whether I get both. So it's safer to just super cancel. That was an accident. Supposed to be heavy fireball. Didn't have charge. Now I'm just trying to play positionally. I think I win this, but he gets kind of close. If I remember. I thought about red parrying this. I think I attempted to red parry the second one, just missed it. And I threw too soon there. And then that happened. Even if he parried that, I could come in and, and mix him up, and that was still safe if I came in and mixed him up. For example, if he parried two hits, I could get under him in time and stand strong him. And even if he parried both hits of the stand strong, which could be on either side, I could just super jump to safety and he wouldn't even get a punish. That didn't happen because he just died to the X fireball, but it was, you know, pretty dire. I think this one I was like last game. I think. Really, really early by me. Did it like the earliest you can do it and have it still work. And then, you know, it didn't work. I did it the fastest. Then it starts not working. That was a whiff punish. Pretty good one. Really good one. I parried and he didn't even attack. That was not actually, he could have just blocked. But he was still in parry mode. He was just caught off guard, not ready to go for a parry straight into the cross-up block. But he could have just held forward on the second parry, for example. And if this is the last match, then I get a perfect, because I got a perfect on the last match. So we'll find out right now. I had a full jumping combo there. I got the dumbest dizzy juggle ever. I like didn't even, I couldn't even, I was like, what do I do here again? He tries to parry out, which is not a bad idea, but then I get a nice high connect stun juggle. And then I just do this, and then I like go back into chicken for some reason. My brain just turned off. And then I still get the kill. Good little set with this guy. 